Hey, hey, yo, it's your boy Lona and I'm back. I said I'm back for another video. What's up, y'all? It's your boy Lona, and yes, I'm back for another video. Listen, man, today, y'all, as you can see, I'm already eating. I'm sorry. I know the title say that I'm doing a mukbang. I should have waited for y'all. I nigga hungry. I nigga I'm hungry as hell. Listen, man. If you're new to the channel right now, you don't know who I am, I go by the name of London's Way, and I make dope content, man. Subscribe to the channel, man. We're officially on the road to 100K. Yes, gang, 100K. I'm saying subscribe to the video, like this video, give this channel to your mom or your cousin, everybody. Listen, man, today, y'all, I'm about to tell y'all a hilarious story time on the first time that I got hit the gas. You know what I'm saying? Now, listen, I don't smoke. That's number one. I don't smoke because of this reason right here. Now y'all gonna be laughing at me, <laughs> making it funny, but I don't care, but I gotta tell the truth. You know what I'm saying? Y'all my family, so I gotta air it out on camera. You know what I'm saying? And I'm eating some wings and some Cajun fries. Um, I was almost done. So your boy been killing this shit. But yeah, man. Like I said, man, I'm sorry that I haven't been uploading as consistent as I have in the, in the uh, last few weeks. But like I said, my cousin has passed away. And it's putting a lot of stress on me and my family. So, you know, I just been uploading as I can. You know what I'm saying? That's why I got out here. I know y'all probably was looking for a prank or something, but I got out here just to keep my face in front of y'all. You know what I'm saying? I'm not, I have not took in more than one day off. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm going to stay in front of y'all face. Yeah, let's get to this story time. I know that's what y'all here for. Y'all want to hear. Now, listen, this is going to sound kind of bad. So, the first time that I've ever hit the gas, I was 13 years old. <laughs> I was 13 years old. He needs some milk. And my best friend who passed away, Costa, he tatted on me. This nigga just kept saying, yo, bro, come on, bro. I'm in the seventh grade at the time, 13 years old. I'm a kid. Never tried to smoke prior or none of that. You know what I'm saying he had already tried it once. He's like, bro, you gotta try it, bro. It's crazy. That's a crazy feeling, man. We be lit. You know what I'm saying? We wasn't saying lit back in 2010, but I don't know what we were saying. We turned up. Something like that. So I'm like, you know what, bro? I'm about to try to get high. I'm about to try to get lit. Fuck it. Yo, when I say the first puff that I took, I was coughing like at least for 20 minutes. <coughs> then on top of that, every time I would hit the blunt like this, I would swallow the smoke. Oh no. I would swallow the smoke every time. I don't know why. So I'm, I'm like, okay, feeling good. You know what I'm saying? Coughing, coughing. As I'm getting used to, you know, how a feels to inhale smoke, everything is good. Like, everything is bad. Look, hold on. Before I even get touch base on this, kids, don't smoke. Don't get lit. Don't listen to your friends. Do not fall for peer pressure. If you are a kid watching this, do not fall for peer pressure. You know what I'm saying? Uh-uh. Wait your time. If you want to do that, wait until you the age to do that, which is 21, whatever, whatever the age it is to start smoking. Don't do it in high school. Stay focused. Stay focused on them books. You know what I'm saying? Your boy London's way might reward you, give you $100 on your cash app. Not fall for the peer pressure. I don't care who it is. It could be your best friend, your auntie, your cousin. Don't do it. It's not good. Back to the story. I'm heading up blunt. I'm like, I'm lit. Everything good. All of a sudden, bro. Something just happened to me. I don't know what it was. Really? I felt like I was in another world. I literally felt like I was in, like, at first it was good. I'm like, I'm high as a bitch, you know what I'm saying? Is that a third? Out of nowhere, it's like, I just start moving like this. In my brain, I'm moving like this. Like, I'm moving, dancing, but I'm moving like this in my head. So everything. And oh yeah, and I'm laughing like so hard. Like my, I've never laughed this hard in my life. I'm ah, 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 laughing like crazy. Like to the point where I can't even stop me laughing. I don't know what's going on. And in my head, I'm like, yo, I'm going crazy. I know I'm going crazy. Help me. Help me, Lord. Please help me, Lord. Lord, am I going to die? Is this my last time on earth? I thought I literally was going to die. Like I literally felt crazy. Like I, I felt like... I got laced. I felt like I got laced. I literally, I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I felt like that night, even though I didn't even know what laced was at 13, I felt like 
somebody had put some stuff on my weed. And like, I'm the only one feeling like this. It was with two other people, my best friend and my other friend who happens to name be Adam too. He wasn't feeling like that. I'm the only one in here tripping as they called it. It's like, yo, bro, you tripping, bro. Ain't nothing wrong with this. We, we high. You over here talking about, yo, listen, I was so high, I said I want to go to the hospital. I wanted to go to the hospital. I was that high. Like, I swear to God. At this point, I'm going crazy. Like, I'm literally paranoid. I'm just like, yo, I don't know what's going on. I'm telling my friend I'm about to go to the hospital. He's like, bro, you're not going to the hospital, bro. You good, bro. You just got to let the high sink in. I'm waiting, I'm waiting, I'm waiting for the high to sink in. All of a sudden, this is the scariest part that always scared me with hitting the gas. Bro, I could not feel my legs. I could not feel my legs, bro. And I, I swear to God, bro, every time I walk, it felt like, I don't even, it's like my legs was tingling at both legs. I'm sitting over here like stumping and I can't feel my legs, bro. It's, it was numb. Y'all, I know y'all probably laughing at me, but my legs was numb, bro. Like, my legs was literally numb. I could not feel my legs, and I literally was, like, panicking, bro. I, I, I think I even cried that night. Like, bro, I'm going crazy. Like, I can't feel my legs, and my mind is going crazy. Like, I'm seeing, I swear to God, y'all, I'm not lying to y'all. Y'all probably think I'm over-exaggerating, bro. I could not feel my legs. It was tingling. I'm, I'm closing my eyes. I'm seeing X's. I'm seeing... Fucking squares, make, I'm, it's like literally, I'm closing my eyes trying to go to sleep at this point because I want to sleep it off. I can't sleep. I just cannot go to sleep. So every time I close my eyes, I'm seeing uh, boxes do this, circles going to X's, A, B's, and C's, all type of crazy shit, bro. Like I literally, I literally was going crazy. I felt like I was like dying. Like I felt like I was being called home to heaven. Like I didn't know what was going to happen to me that night, bro. Like. I literally went crazy, like, bro, bro, I never want to relive that time again. But guess what? I did. Oh, no. So here comes another story. So after that night, I wake up. Oh, no, no, I got to keep going. I wake up the next morning, and I still feel high. My legs is not back to normal. But me, I still feel high as fuck. I'm talking about, like, I feel like life is, like, moving in circles like i'm still feel high bro like i go to school the next day i'm feeling high bro like why am i high still like i don't know if it was my mental doing that to me like i literally felt i'm not gonna lie y'all gonna think i'm over, over exaggerating i really felt high for like two weeks i'm not gonna lie i don't know if it was my mind playing tricks on me or was it just my body reacting to weed uh a certain way but i literally felt high for like two weeks straight i was not myself like my attention span wasn't there like i'm looking this way looking that way I don't know if I had got laced or there was just some bad weed or or like, was I just tripping like a, like a nigga like a, like niggas do you know what I'm saying I don't know what the fuck it was but then here comes Friday again so now my best friend Brandon he like yo we about to get high bro what's up we about to get lit I'm like nah bro you know what I'm saying you see what just happened last time he like bro listen. That was probably because that was your first time smoking. So listen, I gave it the benefit of the doubt. I'm like, you know what, bro? You are right, that's why you my nigga. And then this happened, and then I found out why. He he was my, he, that's my nigga, but that night he was not my nigga because he lied to me. Bro, I got high again. I'm good, smoking the blunt. I'm good, I'm good. All of a sudden, it's like a, it's like a, it's like a light switch that hit on just ting. Now I'm doing this again. Now my mind going crazy. And now I'm like, oh my God. Why am I, like, why is this happening again? So now I'm going up and I'm like, bro, it's happening again, bro. Are y'all full of, and I'm like, I'm hoping that they say they going through the same thing so that I don't got to be in this alone. So I'm going up to my boys like, yo, bro, tell me you feeling like this, bro. They like, hell nah, we ain't feeling like that. Nigga. What the fuck is you talking about, nigga? I'm like... I'm just feeling so crazy. I'm feeling down. I'm I'm so confused. Like my legs is tingling again. I'm thinking it's the end of the world. Like I'm, I'm never smoking again. Never in my life. Like that's how a nigga felt, bro. Like a nigga did not want to smoke no more, bro. Like if you would have felt how I felt, bro, you would never want to smoke again. I literally, I literally had the worst experience getting high for the first couple times ever. Like. I never want to get high again. Like that, that right there was enough for me to say no, 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 
never want to get high again, bro. So kids, do not get high if you don't want to go through what I went through. Like, you don't want to, oh, 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 I'm really rock on any block. Whoa. You don't want to feel like that, like, for real, man. I really went through some shit, bro. I went through some crazy ass shit, bro. Oh, my God, bro. Like a dumbass. That was not my last time smoking. Now, I'm not going to lie. Sometimes I would hit it, the blunt, and I'd be good. And then sometimes I hit the blunt again, and now I'm back to square root, where I'm feeling crazy in my legs, and I don't know why I kept doing it. So now I just, I don't smoke. I never really, I never really was a smoker. Like, I would never smoke, like, weekly, yo. Every week I got to hit the blunt. It was on some, like, every fucking six months. And, nigga, if I hit the blunt, nigga, three times in a year, best believe two of them times, it was a bad experience. Maybe one of them shits, I felt the good high. But what I do like, I like CBD. But I don't really like smoking at all, you know what I'm saying? I don't really like the feeling of being anything, you know what I'm saying? I just like being high off life, you know what I'm saying? High off y'all, you know what I'm saying? When y'all view these videos, y'all get me high. So if y'all want me to be high off life, keep viewing these videos. And if y'all want me to eat, yo, listen, watch those ads, man. Listen, for me, watch the ads. I'm trying to do YouTube full time, gang. I'm trying to do YouTube full time, making my full time job. Please watch them ads for your boy London's way and click on them ads for me. You know what I'm saying? Now, I ain't telling you to sit over here and watch a 26-minute ad, because I'm skipping that shit, too. But if the ad is like two minutes or a minute, man, watch that shit, man. Watch that. Watch it for me, so I could be a full-time YouTuber. Man, listen, it was terrible. I swear to God, I never want to smoke. I'm never, I would never hit a blunt again in life. Like, in life, and that's on G-O-D. I will never hit a fucking blunt ever again, man. It's, it's just over. Like, it's not for me. Like, some things people can do, and I always wonder, like, why is it, why it ain't for me? Like, why? Well, I ain't gonna say it look cool when people do it, but, like, when people be talking about they smoking on cookies, I be, I be feeling like they really smoking and inhaling. Do it taste like cookies? Like, when people be smoking runts and cookies and all these flavors, do it, do it taste like it? You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know, man. I just be wondering, like, why me? Like, why it don't work for me? You know what I'm saying? Why it work for them? But when I try to smoke, it's like, nigga, you ain't supposed, that, that blunt hit me like, nigga, you ain't supposed to be smoking. You know you can't handle it. That's how it feel. But when them niggas smoke, it's like, yeah, sir, you can have whatever you like. Yeah. But for me, it's some bullshit. I just never understood, bro. But moral of the story is, kids don't smoke. I ain't smoking. You know what I'm saying? So if you ain't, if I ain't smoking, nigga, you shouldn't be smoking. Because if you run the game... You know what I'm saying? We doing the same thing, and I'm going to come to your house and fuck your mama. You already know. You know what I'm saying? So, listen. Subscribe to the channel, man. Listen, man. After Today is Thursday. After tomorrow, gang, when my cousin gets buried and um, he has his funeral, I'm going to be back to the grind. I'm going to be back to the double uploads and back to the bangers, bangers, bangers. And I promise y'all, that's on my soul. That's on G.O.D., y'all. I appreciate everybody who has been rocking with me. Uh, as I've, as me and my family has been going through this death, this tragic death of my cousin, um, I just want to say I appreciate how I appreciate y'all for being so understanding of what I'm going through, and that's why I love y'all and y'all are my family, y'all. So continue to support me, continue to like these videos, watch the ads, subscribe to the channel, tell your friends, your cousins, everybody about your, about our channel, because this is our channel, it's not my channel. We're a family, so this is our channel. Continue to tell them about your channel, y'all. And I love y'all. I just want to tell y'all, thank you so much. We're just officially on the road to 100K. Gang.